Has everyone watched Big Brother this evening? What were our thoughts? I've got Late and Live on in the background. Olivia is on it. Gaza fell out of bed. I, I saw it and he, he revealed that, that tattoo to the world. Bloody hell. I mean, wh whatever floats your boat, Gaz. But like, like, just poor Kate Middleton. He just is the definition of the embarrassing cringe uncle, isn't he? He does everything in his power to, to sort of out cringe himself. And uh, Tyler made a very good point that he was insinuating that people were actually interested in him before the show and said that he wants to change the perception. I don't think anyone actually cared who you were, Gaz, I'm afraid, babes. Maybe, would you agree with me? I don't know. Oh, the fall was fake. Interesting, very interesting, maybe. I'm just happy we didn't have to see him rap again. Like, that, that's made me happy. Louis with the bed. That was actually quite a lot, wasn't it? But as a, for entertainment, I think Louis's quite good um, because he, he, he isn't very well media trained, um, which, which is great as a viewer because he causes loads of trouble for himself. The black sheep of the royal family. No one's ever called him that, like, before Gary went on. Like, come on. he. Well, he's doing it for the money, and he's doing it for a bit of fame. He likes the attention. What did I just hear? You agree with me? Yes. Jordan agrees with me. It is weird watching it without us being in there and just seeing these other people inside the same house. It's very bizarre. If they changed up the design and stuff, it'd feel less weird. But because it's literally the same, it's very bizarre. I love your jumper. Thank you so much. It's from a brand called Picante. I love that I'm drinking a gin and tonic in bed. Cheers. <laughs> What's my favorite season of Celebrity Big Brother? I mean, <sighs> I mean, it has to be the, that ultimate series with sort of, um, Gemma and David's dead and everything like that. Or Kim Woodburn, Jedward. Tim Woodburn series without his dad. <laughs> Jordan, I thought you said you weren't involving yourself in this live. You know what? I'm disengaging now, okay? <laughs> I'm I'm disengaging. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the gift. Um, I... Yeah, I, actually, I think you're right, Jordan. That is, um... That is true. The Kim Woodburn, Jedward thing when she goes, I think you're a little bitch, actually. Oh, Nikita seems really cute. He hasn't really said much yet, but, um, yeah, hopefully he will come out of his shell a bit more. Sometimes it takes a bit of time, but this is the thing with the celebrity version. They only have three weeks. They've got, they've only got three weeks. Um, we had a lot longer to sort of come out of our shells, I think. Because relationships might only start to really kind of form like after the two week point and then we've only got a few days before the final. Always loved you from day one. Oh, that's very sweet. Thank you very much. Jordan's a bit worried that I might be going into Celebrity Duke Brother as a late arrival because my eye still appears on the opening credits. Go, go. 
I'm going in. Good. I'm going to go in and chat to them all and sort them all out. Yeah. Jordan doesn't know that I've secretly been in talks as a late arrival. I have a nice eye. Thank you very much. We miss you idgeballing. I'm idgeballing all the time. The idgeball king. Cheltenham calling. I, we're going to Cheltenham races. I'm very excited. I enjoy, I enjoy that. It's always a good day. Oh, Andrea, good question. Who would Vi put in the danger zone? I think... I think Sharon did a good job choosing the... I, I mean, definitely Gary would have been the one at the end because he's just insufferable. I think he'd be one of the hardest to live with. Um, the other two, though, I'm not sure. Because I actually think David and Zizi will be quite entertaining to watch. Then everyone else seems okay as well, so I don't really know. Fern seems really nice. I'd have quite liked a Fern in the house. I'd have quite liked that kind of maternal sort of person to confide in. Jordan, apparently your lips are in the opening credits as well. Are you watching? I think Jordan might be lucky on here on a burner account. Yeah, fan would have been nice. Uh, no. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, he doesn't think they're on it. Oh, thank you, Paige. Who do you want to be evicted? <laughs> Part of me is like Gary because he's the one I'd least like to live with. But then I also quite like to watch Gary making a fool out of himself. And it keeps me engaged. I, I don't know what they would show on television if it wasn't for those more exciting characters. Um, so, yeah, it's interesting. A Nepo uncle. That's a very that's a very good way of putting it. Gary is a Nepo uncle. I, I, you know, I see Zizi and David talking. The thing is, right, the nominations have happened. They know. How is Vicky Patterson? Iconic. Love her. She is so, so lovely. She's the sweetest um, person. Um, a great interviewer as well. Made us feel really, really comfortable. Um, are we allowed to say when the podcast comes out, darling? Comes out tomorrow. The pot. It comes out tomorrow. A very quick turnaround. I don't think that's public knowledge yet. But that's fine. Now it is. Someone put Buzzfeed could never. Do, do, do. Sorry, I'm just trying to read these. They're going very quickly. We didn't see all the pic uh, all the questions for the podcast. Um, at the end, they did some kind of like questions that had been sent through. Um, but yeah, it was interesting to hear some of them, guys. Um, a lot of fun. Oh, I think that was the moment for me when Sharon was just having a proper lie-in and said good morning at, like, 1pm. Does anyone else find that hilarious? I don't think a lot happened in this episode. Like, there wasn't anything particularly, like... Because I saw a couple of people on Twitter saying, like, this is one of the best episodes of Celebrity Big Brother ever, and I just... 
I was like, was I watching the same thing? I thought it was a great, I thought it was a, a good show as always, but I didn't feel like a lot actually happened. And we kind of know, like we knew Gary was being put up before the show had even started. I don't know. I'm guessing you didn't watch about your series. I actually did watch it back uh, potentially a couple of times. It was the only thing I could focus on after it came out. Yeah, it'll be good when nominations start, when they have to like really kind of put put each other up. Your series is the best. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Who do you think will clash first? I think Gary ZZ as well. She she's quite opinionated and quite sort of. I think she'll she'll hold her ground and like I, if she doesn't agree with something she hears, she'll she'll get like argumentative. I think. Um, so I think ZZ will probably be, mark my words, she'll be in the middle of the first argument that goes on, I reckon. I don't know. Or Gary. I think if someone tries to start an argument with Louis, Louis will just tell them to calm down and then just walk away. I don't think he would actually engage in... I think he'll annoy people. I think Louis is going to really annoy people, but I don't think he will actually engage in an argument. I know Louis kicking Lauren out of bed. That was that was that was really bad. I would have, I would have been in that diary room going, "Did you see the way he just spoke to me?" Um, yeah. Hi, Wendy. I'm just going to be sad when Sharon's gone. I wonder if Sharon's going at the same time as the the first person to be evicted. Do your Scotty T accent. <laughs> Maybe, maybe maybe that might appear in uh, the podcast tomorrow. Who knows? Oh, yeah, I can hear Olivia in the background. <laughs> she can, yeah, she's doing a good job. There she is again, bloody hell. Um, <laughs> how's your caviar on crisps? Fantastic. What a snack. Like, I was sent, I was sent some re- recently from Fortnum's and I just had to use it all up. That I used to watch Geordie Shaw. I actually have never watched it. But I've I see things like I've on, on TikTok. Sometimes I get Scotty T come up, and I think he's like a modern day Shakespeare. Like some of the things he comes out with. Like, didn't he say something along the lines of like, "I've grilled more birds than George Foreman"? Yes. Jordan's kind of half involved in this live and half no, not involved. I'm not listening to this. I'm listening to Beethoven. <laughs> You're listening to Beethoven? 
Thoughts on Tato chips? They're the best. They come from Ireland, don't they? Um, I've had them before. They're really good. They do them at the Devonshire, which is the pub I often frequent in Soho. Louis. Louis again. Louis. 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 This is my late in life. Well, welcome. <laughs> Thoughts on Will I Am? Baby, we don't stop and we don't quit. That's all I've got to say. Oh, thank you. I've got a heart on my head. Is Jordan like... <laughs> no, he's actually downstairs. We have a mezzanine, a bit like in the house. Like, I think we walked in and wanted something that was quite similar to the house. Can I turn this around and try and show you? Is that a thing? Flip camera. Look, a mezzanine. So he's down, down there. Aren't you, darling? Give us a quick hello, darling. Hello. Yes. Hello. He's still there. Oh, my God. Hello. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? Okay. Just leave him to it, to be honest. <laughs> was I annoyed at my sister fleeing that video? No, not really. Uh, I mean, initially I was like, "Oh gosh, how embarrassing," but I think it, I think it's done wonders. She was she was like she did what she needed to do. Um, she felt really bad, and then everyone was loving it. So why not? Well, thank you for the potatoes, Tom. I've never been been sent a potato before. What, what's what's a potato? Pop the question to George. Mm. At some point. Comment on what Frida said. I don't really know what she said. All I, I think I, I just saw a very quick clip of her apparently telling Jordan to break up with me. Mm, sad. <laughs> the pot noodle. I've not had a pot noodle since the house. Jordan got sent some the other day from pot noodle. Um, I haven't gone near them yet. Maybe, maybe potentially I'll have to try one. Um, the mayonnaise is still haunts me in my mind. Um, you didn't really get a visual on the top of that pot noodle that Jordan was eating. There was this like thick layer of like hurdled mayonnaise. It was quite something. I bet Sharon cannot wait to get out of that house. Jordan, are you in this live? Are you not? I'm not in the live, but I do think Sharon wants to be out of that house. <laughs> Jordan reckons Sharon's desperate to escape. I'm surprised she's been in this long, to be fair. I wish she'd walk out for the first 24 hours. Yeah. She does not. It's just a, it's a, why would she have to be there? Jordan, join from downstairs for very quickly. Pardon? Join from the spare room very quickly. I'm not in the spare room. <laughs> Where's my phone? It's in my pocket. Okay, Jordan's gonna come and cameo for, okay, for two minutes. Okay. For two minutes. He he how was. Do how do I join? Want well, just come, just come on the live, darling. Um, Did I just see you? I don't. Oh, there you are. Invite. Oh, here he is. No, I don't know. Why am I only using audio? I can't see you. Right, hello. Darling, oh, no, you can't see me yet. We want to see your beautiful face. I know, I'm, I'm in makeup at the moment. You're in makeup? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Look at that. What a mess. 
I'm trying to, I'm just looking through things. I, Cause I never go live, so I, I don't see all this stuff. You're a nightmare. No, wait. I look at the hole. <laughs> Someone just said Roddy from Flushed Away for the last. Oh, one. don't give me that. I've heard that one before. This, this one's very scary. Sorry, darling. I don't um, even know how you're doing this. I don't, I don't know how. Do I? I don't know how I do anything. <laughs> but yes. I love that in between these filters, it just goes to nothing. <laughs> Look at that one. How cute. It's a good moisturizer, darling. Jordan, I think people wanted you on here not... <laughs> I'm trying to flick the ears. Oh, I have to do it like that. <laughs> Right. Okay. Sorry. What were we, were we saying? Um, <laughs> Don't he can't just, does this, which one makes me look younger? <laughs> what is going on? No, we were saying about Sharon. Donnie, we can't see your face. Why can't you? We want to see your face. I know I'm changing the filter. I'm distracted. <laughs> Hello. Oh. I, have that, on now. I, I don't. I feel dishonest using this filter. I, I'll go back to my usual civilian. I feel dishonest. Right, oh, there, we go. there Hi. you are. Gordon is in the building. Hello, handsome boy. Hello. Hello. Oh, what's that? I'm sat on. Someone the... wants your completely unfiltered thoughts on Gary Goldsmith. I can't stand him. Why does he have a tramp stamp? What's that all about? <laughs> I'm falling out the bed. <laughs> Henry, are you okay? I think so. Thank you for that. Um, I, I don't understand in the falling out of bed thing. I, I mean, yeah, that's cute. Did he rehearse that? Um, yeah. It was quite something. Gary Goldfish, yes, I agree. <laughs> Colson looked very distressed by the fall. Maybe Kate knew he was going to do this a few months ago, so she thought, fuck this, I'm sorry, F this, I don't want to swear. Are you okay. allowed to swear on TikTok Live? You are allowed to swear on TikTok Live, yeah. Okay, well, she thought, oh God, fudge this, I'm, I'm going into hiding for some time. <laughs> My darn uncle, I haven't spoken to him in years and years and decades and decades and centuries and centuries. He's going into the house. Damn, I must go into hiding. Forthwith. Forthwith. I do think Colson, bless him, has picked the short straw home to share a bed with him. Oh, I know. I, I, I really like Colson now. He seems like a very genuine soul. Oh, he seems very sweet, doesn't he? Yes. I don't know what the betting odds are at the moment. I don't know how they've changed since the since that episode. Well, I mean, I, I have seen betting odds, but you know me, I don't understand them. I don't know what two to one or five to seven is. I don't know what it means. I'm not You're a betting man. You're the horse races, darling, next weekend. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm not planning to bet. I'm planning to drink Pims. Is it too early to drink Pims? Oh, hello. Thank you. I have a crown. I need to drink Pims. Okay. I'm going to become ever more entitled because I had a crown. So are the people doing this to us then when they put stuff on us? I think I think they're doing it to us. Yes, they're putting things on us. I'm going to be like Kerry when she said to Farida, "People watch you," and then now she's a TikTok <laughs> live fanatic. That'll be me. You ask me, darling, what are you doing? I'm, I'm just going TikTok live. So what's the my bread and butter to win, Nikita? We want Nikita to come out. Oh, of the I show. really like Nikita. Nikita yes. is such a. He seems like such a nice chap, and yeah. I hope, obviously, in the edit, you only get to see a certain amount. Like, he's probably very chatty for the rest of us. Oh, God. Oh, yee-haw. Oh, no, we, we can't say what we said last night. Ah. Was that last night we did a live? Uh, no, I can't Was remember. Night, no, night. we went to the theatre last night. Oh, uh, OK, yes. Oh, um, oh my goodness. Stranger Things now. at the theatre. Go and watch it. Hashtag gifted. Not to me, to him over there. Oh, I've got a hat. Thank you. Ekansu Nation, yeah, we like a bit of Ekansu. Um, But no, like Sharon, I, I think she seems like she just cannot be asked to be, oh, oh, I've got glasses. She's nonchalant, she's like, oh, get me through this. Get me back to LA. I, I think they're moving back to um, England soon anyway, but yes, we talk more in depth about all that stuff on Vicky's podcast which should be released tomorrow, as Henry has said to you. And we also talk about our future ventures. Yes, you probably said a bit too much. Oh, 
whether they'll put it all in or not. There was like, what, what does the future hold? And then me and Jordan went on a massive diatribe that maybe our agents will shout at us about. But oh well. Henry and I are going to become posties because we love walking around London. And so stardom is not for us. Oh, oh, look at that teddy bear. Oh, it's you, Henry. <laughs> Opinions on David. Um, Henry likes him more than I do. <laughs> no, I think David is actually quite a sweet guy. I mean, he's probably great on people just because of his quite abrasive nature. But then, I don't know. I think deep down he's actually quite a sweet guy. I don't know why. I Mark think. Jenkins from the hotel. I, I've heard he's not quite well at the moment, but he would be brilliant on uh, Celebrity Big Brother. I mean, if you haven't already, just watch the hotel on YouTube. I, I love all that. The hotel, the hotel inspector, all that, you know, just uh, easy Pizzi watching. In. Pardon? They need to get Alex Polizzi in. Oh, Alex Polizzi, yes, definitely. And Ruth Watson, Country House Rescue, and the Hotel Inspector. They're just, uh, I love watching those types of shows. Cheers, darling. Oh, cheers. I, I don't have alcohol because it's TikTok Live and I adhere to the rules, unlike you. That wasn't alcohol, that was sparkling water. Are you two dating? Um, I don't know, are we, darling? I... Depends on the hour of the day, I suppose. Mm. What am it's I wearing to the it. Eras tour? Um, I don't know. I, I suppose I'm just going as myself. Thoughts on tortoises? Get Jim Royal in, yes. Tortoises, yes. Yes, just as yes. <laughs> I mean, tortoise thingies um i, I don't know they're, they're they're quite slow but then i'm quite slow as henry will enlighten you they're so in the house you know picking up on feelings and all that stuff that is, this is henry's necklace version two because i because i go like that a lot the first one just burst wait that one darling so did you just want I know, to I've got the bloody hell i've got it tangled on tiktok sorry for saying bloody on tiktok i don't you can say bloody. I think you can say any word. On no, Twitter. no, you don't. You keep it age appropriate, darling. Okay. But yes. Oh, you love the AJ vid um, interview. Yes. I mean, AJ is just brilliant. And to have that interview, it was fabulous. Yeah. It was nice. It was nice to be back, wasn't it? Although a bit crazy and scary. Is Jordan a socialist? Well, well, I'm not a Tory, so. <laughs> He's a champagne bloody socialist. That's what he is. I, I no, I, I, I no. I'm a, probably a white wine socialist. Lambrini. No, Lambrini gives you a he headache. But no, prosecco. Just give me prosecco. Are you going to be on late and live again? Um, well, at the moment, I, I don't have any bookings. But Henry, you're going to. Yes. I believe so. I hope they put a little plastic chair next to the stage and I can sit on it <laughs> when you're doing yours. <laughs> Outfits for Cheltenham. Jordan, you need to sort yours out. I need oh, to sort mine out as well. Mm. Jordan will probably wear brown because it's mud. Yeah, you know, mud. Opinion Louis Walsh, I did not like how he spoke to Lauren, going up, 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 out my bed. But then Louis, Louis's kind of this, he's this, he is just, he, he's like a naughty schoolboy, which is no excuse, but still, he's just, oh, he, he grinds my gears. I want to put him in detention and leave him there. I want to lock him in a detention room. Not false imprisonment, no, legally speaking, but just, he's impish. Impish. For those that don't know what the phrase, the word impish means. Love that for you, darling. Thank you. When are you going to the Taylor Swift Eras tour? Beverly Macker on CBB, yes. What Any more Lego? Think, sorry, they just talked about it. What did we think about that little song and dance? Which little? Oh, oh, it's, uh, I don't know. Why are, they, why are they, you know, stooping to that level at this yeah, I feel it's like still that quite would early. It's happen, like quite late, like much later on. This is I like know it's, it's... day three, and they're like singing and dancing, singing "Come exactly. They Are" around the campfire. Hmm. I think on day two we were lining each other up, weren't we? We were yeah. talking about this earlier. We are in the same place, but Henry's upstairs. I'm downstairs. You're in the guest bed. You're in the doghouse. Well, so. yeah, but I haven't done anything wrong. Don't worry. I'm, I'm... 
I'm just. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I think they, they need to throw in a few more spanners. I, I know they've had this big bombshell with Sharon doing the twist and stuff, but there needs to be more spanners. I mean, these are celebrities. We were civilians. We didn't know anything about, you know, stardom, whatever else. But these people are trained. They're PR trained. They can handle a few more spanners in the works. I don't know if they're going to start throwing in tweets to the house and whatever else. We were always terrified, weren't we, darling, of them showing our diary rooms, of them putting in tweets to the house because it would affect our behavior naturally. It, like in the Channel 5 days. So I don't know if they're going to do that this run. I know they showed Sharon's diary room, which I, I suppose was a big thing. But anyway, I'm, I'm talking about sh shite. Oh, they have a spanner. It's called Gary. Yes, I suppose so. The Brits was great, other than being sat next to this lout who started dancing on his chair and um, being a bit raucous and mischievous. And but then you okay. followed my lead. <laughs> Opinions on Farida? Well, I, I mean, I, I wouldn't be giving relationship advice to anyone, so I, I don't know why some people seem the need to. Rawr. <laughs> um, when's the wedding, guys? Well, I don't know, Henry. You tell me. <laughs> Someone just asked to see my feet, I think. And oh, oh, I mean, we're not in that business. I know the business can be quite lucrative from you know what you read online and whatever else. But yeah, we're we're not in the business of providing feet pictures. I'm I'm terribly sorry. I mean, Henry, you might be. I don't know. We need to get the money in. So. <laughs> afraid not whip your socks off think, yeah uh, maybe seeing what we're do how we're doing like in six months um get the dogs out oh my god will these lives be regular um they probably won't be that regular but when they i don't know i they just kind of seem to happen spontaneous spon spon can he can i can you, island Spontaneously is the word I was looking for. Where's Yinran? I think Yinran's very happy. She's moved in with her boyfriend. I, I believe they live um, northeast now. And that they seem so happy with their new place. And we, we hope to see them both soon. She's such a sweetheart. Is Jordan's mum still a social worker? Yeah, oh, yes, she is. And uh, I, I, well, sometimes I think she's trying to be Chris Jenner, but not Chris Jenner. Is it? Yes, it is Chris. Is it Chris? The momager? Yes. Yes, but I'm not letting her. I, I, I'm like, Mum, stay to social work, please. When is let the next me, let love me be me. dropping? Pardon? When is the next love poetry dropping? Um, no, probably when you go away. So maybe Friday, there'll be a poem <laughs> delivered. I'm going back to the Cotswolds. Guys, it's Mother's Day on Sunday. Make sure you treat your mothers um, if you have them. Right, well, I, I, I've loved talking to you all, but I, I think I'm going to drop out now. Henry will keep you company. Right, okay, love you, darling. And love you all too. Thank you for your support. It's always appreciated. Thank you for coming to January late and live. Well, no, you're you're staying on, aren't you? Oh, uh, I'm a guest on January guest late and live. What? You got there in the end, darling. All oh, right, but right, bye, bugger off. <laughs> what do I? I love how Jordan said he was going to come on for two minutes and then came on for like twenty. But I'm also going to turn off, guys, because I'm I'm going to see how Olivia's getting on on late and live. But it's been fabulous speaking to you all. Are you okay, darling? Bye. Bye. I'm going to go and be reunited with my husband. But sorry for distracting you from Will Best. That's that's a terrible loss for you. Lots of love. Bye, guys. Bye.